we issued guidelines for the conduct of branch elections and branch elections alone. We intentionally separated the branch elections guidelines from all the other elections to ensure that everybody will put effort in the branch elections. I want to report that uh, we did a review of the exercise this morning at our Functional Executive Committee. After listening to, uh, taking all the reports from the National Executive Committee members who had been assigned to the various regions, we can report to you that the exercise was an outstanding success. We say so, not oblivious of the fact that for any major exercise of this nature, there will be hiccups in uh, one or two places. And we are very much aware of that. But we want to believe that the, the information about the hiccups has been unreasonably inflated. We have 200 and 75 constituencies. Out of the 275 constituencies, we have challenges in only about 20 constituencies. And out of the 20 constituencies, the challenges don't cover even all the, the, the branches in the constituencies. In several cases, the elections would have been held, but certain elections in certain branches have developed some challenges which have been addressed. But luckily, our regulations are very, very clear. They have shown the way to address these challenges. And so if the national executive and the regional executive uh, committee members have decided to gloss over the problems, we would have reported that this is, we have finished everything. But we want to uh, you know, look out for where the problems exist. And even when we have reports that everything is well and we know everything is not well, we insist that we must do verification and where it is necessary, we even annul the results and order a rerun. And so that is because of the meticulousness of the national executive to ensure that all branches are properly elected. We are taking the trouble to investigate every petition that we have received. And um, so far, the reports indicate that when you go to Upper East, for instance, our biggest challenge is in Bongo constituency and Boko Central. In the case of Bongo constituency, there is a, a legal challenge which we will say is both good and bad. The fact that a branch election, at the level of branch elections, people are prepared to pursue their rights in court, it tells you the importance the party places on the branch elections. So even though uh, we don't think it is a good thing to always resort to court, we, we, we feel that you know, the party at branch level is assuming an extraordinary importance in the organization of the party.